Camelot331 here, and today we're here to talk about the fresh market. In the last three years, voted fifth, third, and first worst places to work at in America. It has to be pretty bad to be voted the worst place in America when companies like GameStop, Walmart, Amazon, Dollar General, places like that exist. But yet, on top of everything, is the fresh market. But why? Why is it so terrible? Well, I have several messages explaining exactly why it's so terrible. And also, some really, really horrifying revelations at the end of it. Let me just say, you probably don't want to shop there after watching this. <laughs> it's pretty nasty, but also pretty hilarious. <laughs> so make sure you find your nearest drainage pipe, because you'll probably get more nutrients than you would at the fresh market. But before we get into it, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, doodle. It's real important. And make sure you subscribe if you haven't. First message. I've been with the company many years, and I've seen a drastic decline in the company as a whole. I am sorely disappointed with the management aspect, especially in their relation with company-wide percentage cutting of yearly raises and bonuses. So the raises and bonuses have been cut. It did recently go public as a public company. That's probably why, because it's corporate now. Rest in peace, everybody. <laughs> these have gone way down these last years. Also, management support has gone down. The quality of middle management is much lower as of late. The assistants that are being hired on are not setting good examples for other employees. This is bringing morale down in situations where department heads are often working longer hours to compensate for lower hours being available. And overtime is not being offered to hourly employees who are willing to work extra to take up some of the slack. Human resources is also lacking. Shocking. <laughs> if complaints are made against management or a favorite person of management, these complaints are not addressed. They're ignored, brushed off, and made light of, even though several people have witnessed these events and have come forward with complaints about the same person. For example, one employee walked off the job, cursed out a manager, and was rehired by the regional manager the next day to work in another store in town. I've moved up through the company to get in the position that I am, but I cannot work for this company any longer. Also, the food is almost exclusively rotten or expired. It didn't used to be this way. Not sure how selling rotten food is legal, but oh well. <laughs> Plot twist, selling rotten food is indeed illegal as hell. But why would they care? Why would they care? Not my produce, not my problem. That's what I say, apparently. Next one. I worked at the Fresh Market, and God, what a horrible store to work at. The management team is a joke where they care a lot about the customers, but couldn't care less about the employees. If an employee does something wrong, they simply punish them, but do not try to help them make sure the mistake doesn't happen again. The management plays favorites, so some people won't get into trouble, even though they mess up a lot. The health and safety conditions of the store is so scary, I wouldn't eat anything there. Again, we hear this for the second time. You don't find out your schedule till a day in advance, which makes it horrible to plan anything. And if you put a request for time off, you most likely won't find out it gets approved until the day before. Did I mention how all the food is expired and they just keep selling it? <laughs> so there it is again. The food is expired and they just keep selling it. Is this true though? We'll find out shortly. Next one. When I first started out at the Fresh Market, I thought it was going to be not so bad. 20% discount, a small store layout, and it's not Walmart. <laughs> I was pretty far off with my expectations for this job. Just to be clear, I only took this job to hold me over until a better one. Employees are basically sucked soulless, getting every bit of worth that they have used until they decide enough is enough. Hence the high turnover rate, which is true. The Fresh Market has an extremely, extremely high turnover rate. There isn't anything rewarding about this job. It's nine hours a day of one person doing the work of three people, with the others playing the that's not my job card. The hour long lunch breaks are unneeded as it's nothing but demotivational. I'd rather have half an hour unpaid lunch, but then they can't get a full eight hours out of you. Anything you do is never enough, so it's almost pointless to give much effort. The low wages aren't nearly enough compensation for the disorganization, the lack of direction, and the I don't know answers to the most questions you ask. If you enjoy time with your family and living your only life, work somewhere else. The job is okay for teenage kids and people in their later years that don't have any other options. Don't even get me started on customers and their sense of entitlement and elitism. So here's what we're finding out. There's a lot of favoritism. Management sucks. Everybody else sucks. Everything's rotten. They're selling expired food. 
There's a lot of disorganization. But it is voted the worst place to work at in America. This must be pretty freaking bad. <laughs> Next message. This is a rough one. When I worked at Fresh Market, there was absolutely no cleaning. That place would have been shut down in a heartbeat. Rats were everywhere. It was a nightmare. I asked the manager when the last time the shelves and produce had been cleaned because they were covered in filth and rotten food and rat droppings. He said probably since the store was opened five years prior. Who doggy? <laughs> I was blown away. People would get sick eating food from there. If you use this, my advice would be to stay away as much as possible. Holy mother of God. <laughs> so we're hearing this a lot. It's a pretty dirty ass place. Everything's rotten and expired. But is that true? Is that true? Well, <laughs> what's this? <laughs> the fresh market has been determined to be the worst place to work at in America. In 2019, the fresh market was designated as the 15th most hated company in America. Damn, son. Damn. <laughs> but let's look at some of this food. Look at this. Look at this thing. It's straight up rotten. And this is on display. Who is expected to buy this? Maybe a raccoon would buy this. Maybe. But raccoons don't carry money on them usually. So it's got to be people. So I'm not going to buy this. When the name of your grocery store is Fresh Market, you self-describe it as upscale and price everything higher than all the other local grocery stores. Customers might expect the produce you sell to be fresh. <laughs> Look at this freshly opened box of cabbage. Look at this. It's straight up rotten, son. It's Look at it. I'm zooming in on it. Look at the rotten ass. This looks like my ass. Prior to wiping. I'm just saying, man. The cabbage is covered. In what looks like mold and many heads are deeply bruised. What's fresh market solution? Just peel back layers until you don't see mold anymore and put it on the shelf. <laughs> no! No! God! One produce manager at the fresh market heard a rumor that the chain is buying their produce second hand. Whatever that means. <laughs> then there are problems of rough handling. Much of the fresh market's produce is damaged by careless produce clerks and bad display design. Look at these poor little zucchini. They got the hell beat out of them. It's so sad. Look at the cucumbers. It looks like somebody took a bite out of that poor guy. Look at the romaine. Oh, it's... What the... It looks like it caught on fire. And it's rotten as hell. No, these aren't magical bendy carrots. They're just old dirty carrots. <laughs> I got an old dirty carrot for you. <laughs> Look at this. This is absolutely insane. Look at this. Oh my God, it's all right. Look at this poor ass bell pepper. It's got the skin on it. It looks like it's an 80 year old man. All these peppers right here. All these peppers. Rotten, 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 rotten. Look at this strawberry. There is mold on the strawberry, man. There's mold on the strawberry, son. Oh my god. Oh my god. I opened this container of raspberries to take a photo. A few minutes later, a produce clerk closed it and left it out for sale. <laughs> oh my god. Look at that! Look at that poor guy. Oh my god, the bag of cherries. Look at this. Look at him. It's 100% rotten, dude. Every one of them. Everything we look at. Everything. Cauliflower. Rotten. Everything's rotten. It's like me. Old, dry, and rotten. But I don't want to eat me. If I wanted to eat a head of lettuce, I don't want it to look like me, man. That's not appetizing at all. <laughs> Just pathetic. So old and dry. Same. Look at these shelves. Remember that lady that said the shelves haven't been cleaned in like five years? Look at this. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Holy mother of God, dude. Look at this. What even is this guy right here? This just looks like a turd. This is just a turd. There's just a turd in, in the beats, man. There's some turds. Be picky about your produce. Your health and your family's health depends on your diligent attention to purchasing fresh and nutritious fruits and vegetables. The higher price stores don't always have the best products. You can find good foods at more reasonably priced grocery stores than the not so fresh market. <laughs> so that's the new name of the fresh market. It's the not so fresh market anymore. This place has been voted the worst place to work at in America and the 15th worst most hated company in America. So what have we learned? Management suck. All the associates sucks. They play favoritism. They'll they'll give you overtime and then they'll just take it away from you. Kind of like Walmart does. They'll just delete it and be like, sorry, you ain't getting no more overtime. There's no organization. Reminds me again of Walmart. <laughs> 
No benefits, no raises, no vacation. You don't get nothing. All you get to do is swim around in rotten food all day. Rotten food. It's the not-so-fresh market. That's what it's called now. So if you're thinking about working for Fresh Market, don't. Because it's terrible. Do not work at Fresh Market. So what do you think? Do you work at the Fresh Market? How's your experience? Make sure you contact me with your experiences. So that's all I have. Make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it. And make sure you subscribe if you haven't. And until next time, make sure that you get on it. Doggone it. Bye. Yeah. <laughs>